What's going on guys, DJ Jammin here. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another video. Welcome back to another gig list. Now real quick before I start, I'm filming in a random spot in my house, so don't worry about the background, but also I hope you guys notice a difference in audio because I'm trying out some new mics. Yeah, I got a lavalier on today. This is the Sennheiser EWG4 and I like it a lot. I hope you guys like the sound difference. Um, they're pretty pricey, so I think I'm gonna keep them. Uh, they're, I mainly bought them for the secondary channel that I'm starting with Austin that is almost up and running. I promise that it'll be up and running shortly. Can't get this thing back in my pocket. Okay. So yeah, second channel's happening shortly here. Um, promise that I'll announce it once it's started. So moving uh, right along, this gig that I'm about to show you guys today, it's kind of another gig log, but kind of not. So pretty much two weeks ago, I think now, uh, I did a four day conference with a production company in Chicago called High Frequency Production. It's actually my buddy Juan's company, super nice guy. The link's down below to go check out all of his stuff. For four days, we were at the Weston O'Hare down in Rosemont, Illinois. We were doing production for the 2018 YJA conference. Now, I had no idea what YJA was, uh, YJA was going into the conference, um, but now I know it's the Young Janes of America, and it's pretty much a, um, I don't really know how to explain it with trying to be politically correct. It's a part of the Indian religion, I guess is the way that I can put it. Um, but it was pretty much just a youth retreat, and I believe it's biennial, so every two years uh, they have this conference. This year was in Chicago. So, with that being said, for the four days we were there, we were providing full production for this conference. So we had the main grand ballroom that had the huge setup. If you follow me on Instagram, which you guys should, it's right, uh, I'll put it right here. Uh, make sure to follow me on Instagram, but if you are following me, you saw the picture of the setup, but pretty much we had a gigantic setup in the grand ballroom. And then besides that, there were 28 other like breakout rooms that we had to take care of as far as providing screen and projectors, um, speakers, microphones, stuff like that for their little breakout sessions throughout the day. Aside from like the keynote speakers and just like everyone being together in the, the grand ballroom. So, it was, it was a lot of work, and if you're starting to get into production, um, just know it's a lot of hard work, and if you don't want to do hard work, if you don't want, like long days, like working seven in the morning till three in the morning the next day, not the business for you. Moving into, I guess I'm just gonna go down uh, quickly what gear we used as far as lighting, because that was my job, I was the LD for the show. So you'll see a picture right now. On the back truss, we had 30 feet going across, I believe, so three sections of 10 foot trussing. On the front, we had 40 feet of trussing, I believe, four sections of 10 foot truss. Then on, going back to the back truss, we had ran four Chave R2 washes and six Chave Hybrid 140 SRs, and then the video wall. On the stage, we ran two more hybrid 140 SRs as kind of specials, uh, one on each side of the stage. Then moving to the front truss, we ran eight more R2 washes and four more hybrid 140 SRs. I also forgot to mention on the back truss, there were two Chave shockers, uh, which are kind of like blinders, but that makes for a total of two Chave shockers, 12 R2 washes, and 12 hybrid 140 SRs along with the video wall. To control everything, I ran a Lenovo Yoga as well as an M-Touch and an M-Play. And that was pretty much the setup for the Grand Ballroom. That's pretty much the rundown. Enjoy the video. Make sure to stay to the end of the video. I am announcing my upload schedule. What? Yeah. Finally, after so many videos, I've come out with an upload schedule that I'm going to try my best to stick to. And pretty much, I don't care if I get one view or if I get 10,000 views, I just wanna put these videos out to help teach you guys. And yeah, that, that's, that's pretty much my goal. So 
Enjoy the video, we'll see you back here at the end.
guys hope you enjoyed the video once again huge shout out to my buddy juan and high frequency productions please make sure to go like their facebook page check them out the link is down below if you ever need production high frequency is your company to go to now moving on to the upload schedule super quick here mondays are going to be mixed days so i'm not sure if i'm going to do a live stream mix or if i'm just going to upload it and have it on as one of my videos so i will let you guys know in tomorrow's video i think i have another video coming out so tuesdays are going to be tip days so tuesday tips can range from business tips to dj tips to equipment tips stuff like that and that's pretty much it for tuesdays wednesdays i have open right now so i'm still trying to think of something to do on a wednesday if you have any suggestions please let me know down below thursdays are going to be kind of cool they're going to be throwback gig logs. So Ryan, my boss, owner for Sure Entertainment, has so much footage from gigs before I was even like working for him or doing gig logs. So I'm going to try to put together kind of like a gig log or a commentary every week, starting from like the oldest footage that he has and working up until I started uh, pretty much filming, uh, filming his gigs. So that'll be Thursday. And then Friday and Saturday, are usually gigs so those will be gig logs pretty much and then Sunday this will be the big one if I decide to do it Sundays either every week or every other week I'm gonna try to do a giveaway 
So I'm gonna try to start super small, and as the channel grows, I'll be able to do larger stuff, but it seemed like I had some really good engagement from uh, doing the microphone giveaway, so I think I'm gonna try to do that, like I said, either every week or every other week. So that's pretty much the schedule, super simple. But like I said in the beginning of the video, I wanna help you guys, I wanna give you guys tips, I wanna help you further better your business if you're owning your own company, stuff like that. So if you have any suggestions or you wanna see something uh, in one of the videos, please let me know in a comment or PM me, hit me up on Instagram or Facebook, whatever you guys wanna to do to reach out. More than happy to accommodate your requests. So with that being said, that's it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Like, comment, share, subscribe, please go hit that subscribe button. Please go check out High Frequency Productions. Really appreciate it if you guys do. So we'll see you in the next one. Peace.